Hey tech enthusiasts, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to dive into the hottest tech deals on the market and I am bringing in gaming monitors, PCs, laptops, TVs, headphones or smartwatches, whatever you can think of. I've got everything you need to know about and the latest and greatest deals for you. So let's get started. So first up, I have Samsung Odyssey Neo G8 gaming monitor. This beast of a monitor is now priced at $999 down from $14.99. That's a massive $500 saving for you guys right there. And if you compare the same thing on Samsung Canada website, you'll get it for $1,300. That's right, $1,300. So I got the best deal for you guys only. What I like the most about this is that it'll give you 4K resolution with 240 Hz, curved screen, and excellent response time with a one millisecond response time, which enhances any type of gaming you do on it you'll love it the only things that i don't like about this is that thousand dollars even after a discount is still a significant investment but i think it would be worth it for serious gamers and secondly it's kind of large in size 32 inch but i mean if you're a hardcore gamer looking to upgrade the samsung odc neo g8 i think this could be the monitor you've been waiting for and whoever out there is on a tighter budget i got you i got the sensui 27 inch wqhd gaming monitor it's only for $247.99, down from $499. That's like a 450% discount. The things that I like about this monitor is the higher fresh rate, less amount compatibility, and affordable price, of course. I mean, this is an excellent value monitor for a 1440p gaming monitor with these specs. The only thing that I think is concerning about this monitor is its build quality and limited features that it provides. But... I mean, if you need a budget-friendly monitor that still delivers good performance, this Hansui model is worth considering for you guys. Let's talk about gaming PCs now. The Asus ROG Strix G13 is currently for $999, down from $1299, saving you $300. The things that I like about this is its solid performance, sleek design, and easy upgradability. You know, you have plenty of room to upgrade components in the future. It's got that cool gamer aesthetic without being too flashy as well. The only things that I hate about this is that it's a mid-range GPU. The RDX 3050 is solid, but it might struggle with most demanding AAA games at the highest settings. And with only one TB storage, heavy users might find themselves needing more space. But at the end of the day, this is a great entry-level gaming PC, especially at this price point. Now talking about the Acer Predator Helios Neo 16. Originally priced at $17.99, now available only for $14.99. The thing that I like the most about this is its high-end performance, fast refresh rate, and a portable design. For a gaming laptop, it is relatively sleek and easy to carry around, and a 165Hz display ensures smooth visuals whether gaming or streaming. The only thing that I hate about this is its battery life, you know, like many gaming laptops expect to be, and heat management issues that most of the laptops face. But overall, the Acer Predator Helios Neo 16 is a fantastic option for gamers who need power on the go. And if you compare it on the Acer website, the same laptop ends up being $17.99. So Best Buy right now is giving it for the cheapest home for $14.99. And you even get 10 special offers. So I'll put the link down below and you can check those special offers for yourself. Now I have this LG 4K UHD LED Smart TV, which was originally priced at $548 and now for $448, so it'll save you $100. This is a 4.5 star rated TV and has over 600 reviews, making it a popular choice for budget conscious shoppers. You know, it'll give you these stunning 4K displays that you get crisp, clear visuals out of, smart TV features, and affordable price, especially for LG 4K TV. The only things that I hate about this is it has an average sound quality, according to me. And secondly, it mentions about a smart remote on the website but you won't get any of those in the box, so you need to buy it for yourself. But other than that, if you're in the market for a budget-friendly 4K TV with smart features, this LG model is a great pick, and you can even check the other dimensions you're selling the same TV for. And now I got the Beats Studio 3 wireless headphones for you guys. Originally for $449.95, it's now only for $199.95, saving you 55%. The same headphones are going for $239.99 on similar websites. So I got the best deal for you there again. The things that I like about this is it's active noise cancelling, comfortable fit for great long listener, 
and solid battery life for up to 22 hours with noise cancellation on. The only thing, there's only one thing that I hate about this is its sound quality, which is not the most balanced as compared to other expensive headphones. But at the end of the day, this is just a great deal if you're a fan of Beats and need a solid pair of noise cancelling headphones for cheap. At the end, I have this Samsung Galaxy Watch 6 only for $249. It's super cheap, perfect for those who want to stay connected and keep track of their fitness goals. The things that I like about this is its stylish design, fast performance, and you know you can run a lot of apps on this without having to worry about it being laggy. The only thing that I hate about this is its battery life. And one thing that I really need you to tell about is this is the international version of the watch, not the Canadian version. So there might be a few apps that won't be working perfectly on the watch. That's why it's selling for super cheap as compared to its original price for a Canadian version. But if you just want the watch for just leisure purposes, why not just only pay 249 bucks, right? So that's all for today's deals. If any of these caught your eye, be sure to check them out before the price go back up. I'll put the link in the descriptions for every one of them. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more tech deals, which I'll bring in regularly. Catch you in the next one. Peace, guys.